Okay, it is midnight. Uh, I guess it's it's 12.01 on December 10th, and I just spent about four hours working on this um, with the gamepad support. So uh, a couple things is if I hold down, it will go through the menu, and then it even goes all the way back up to the top. A little buggy, uh, still working on it, but if I go up, it will go up. And uh, this is kind of slow. I gotta find the right balance of, you know, if I hold it down, it goes rapidly. If, but if I set it on the right timer, it goes up. Working on that. Uh, so if we make a new game, imagine there's music in the background playing. But so here's where we are with the actual game, uh, with actual animations of him walking. Um, this took forever. Um, so if he walks over, you know, then it's, uh, it's actually, uh, he moves, he go he moves in directions. That took forever. I'll show you some of the code real fast. Uh, this is what I've written so far. Just on the main menu. And then here's the, uh, here's the, um, actual game itself so far and all I do is walk I mean there's all of this and I spent probably like seven ten hours I uh, probably like ten hours just on uh, getting that timer it's it goes up 30 minutes every second that's just for testing purposes to have the coin positioned above that this code to have him walk the the most code is the um, you know the walking of the actual cow that took a while with the actual gifts the night cycle, I'm working on the night cycle, I think it's too abrupt. Um, also the cow isn't dimmed, you know, at night he should be darker, I think. Um, so that's something I need to work on. Um, but other than that, I mean, it's got controller support. I guess I'll, I mean, I, I guess I'll add, I don't know why after using a controller anybody would want to use a... I think I might just stick to controller only because like, I mean, how could you not want this, you know what I mean? And it's just really smooth, I think. I think it's really smooth. The only thing is there's a little visual bug when you walk over things, but honestly, I don't think that's that big a deal, considering the fact that there's a day and night cycle. Also, I think I did the sunset really well. I think it looks good. Uh, but considering there's a day and night cycle, you know, when you walk over things, they'll light up. You, uh, Again, it's very abrupt. Um, and then when, you know, there's animations for moving, I'm pretty happy with that. Um, Again, imagine there's music. There's no way to go back to the main menu, but, um, you know, this is still working. Um, so, yeah, you can move like that. So, let's say you can also do this, um, which I need to make it so... Oh, wait. Yeah, I should make it so it doesn't have the one... Like, I, if I want to move over with the mouse, then again, the mouse is kind of obsolete. But for now, I haven't programmed the options... Uh, with the gamepad, so uh, if we click on the options, there is volume. There, I'm listening to music. Now there's none. Uh, if we turn back on, the music starts. Sound effects work. Uh, had, there's no real sound effects yet, so it doesn't really matter, and it plays a loud moo in my ear, so I'm going to hold off. Back works like this. Uh, quit functions correctly. Um, so this is all the code for the actual main menu. Uh, to get the joypad to work and then here is the oh that was actually not for the main menu that was for uh, the game so far and here's just the main menu and so that's where we are with Barnyard 2 so thanks for watching